unaweka yote ni ya kusongora hii <laughs> unaweka 1 liter ya maji na 1 liter mkojo tunachanganya This farmer uses urine from rabbits to grow tomatoes in a greenhouse. We started our journey to his farm in Kablonik village in Nandi county where he is tending his tomatoes in a greenhouse. The lady kwa nafanya kukulima wa sukuma wiki na ikawa ni na, naona mapato yake haikuwa inanitolea tutasheleza mm -hmm. kwanza ukulima wa greenhouse with the increased use of chemical pesticides and synthetic fertilizers in farming cosmos coach wanted to venture into organic farming in order to avoid the use of chemicals organic farming can be defined as an agricultural process that uses biological fertilizers and pest control acquired from animal or plant waste Apart from using organic fertilizers mostly in his farming, Cosmos opted to using urine from his rabbits as foliar spray for tomatoes. Foliar spray is a technique of feeding plants by applying liquid fertilizer directly to the leaves. Plants are able to absorb essential elements through their leaves. According a document by University of Eldoret on the potential use of rabbit urine as biofertilizer foliar feed in crop production, rabbit urine has sufficient levels of nitrogen and can be used to support increased yields in crop production and can be integrated with the use of chemical fertilizers to improve crop yield and soil fertility by reducing soil acidity, since it is a foliar feed only absorbed through leaves of plants. Atutumie folia mini ya tukani sasa mm. Tunachota tu ikifika 20 liters tunarudi shambani Tunaspray tunakaa 2 weeks ina, Inachaa 20 liters tunarudi Iwa iwa tu Rabbit urine is rich in urea which provides plants with nitrogen to promote green leafy growth and make them look lush Cosmos is rearing rabbits from which he harvests urine to use in his greenhouse He says the method has helped in boosting the growth and quality of tomatoes Rabbit urine can also be used as a pesticide to rid off pests and diseases which he is also facing as a challenge in farming. Yenye iko na challenge haiti ni wadudu. Kuna wadudu wenye wanaitwa inaitwa tuta absoluta. Na kuna white flies. Na kuna hii blight. Kuna hii septoria sasa hivi leo kunaangalia hii. The greenhouse farming, he said, is a profitable venture. He learned farming from his parents who were farmers as well as doing online research on farming techniques. Wasasi pia walikuwa wakulima ngawaje ni walikuwa na wakulima wa kufanya fanya ile subsistence haikuwa na ya kufanyia market ya kukula na ya kutumia tu kidogo kidogo lakini yangu nilisikusomea nilifanya hii kasi na ile moyo wa kupenda kazi kuna rafiki nilienda kwake kabisa Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more stories on agriculture.